good morning, guys. Thank you for joining me. I really appreciate you being here. Early this morning in Lake Erie, there was a very small earthquake, a magnitude 2.1, that occurred just before 4 a.m. at 3.53 a.m. local time. Going to Google Earth, here's the location of that 2.1. And just about three weeks ago, there was a magnitude 2.8 in the same location. The 2.8 was on January 4th of this year. And that one was at about 8.20 a.m. local time. And 340 people said they felt that earthquake. The last time any moderate-sized earthquakes were recorded in Ohio was December 12th of last year. That earthquake was originally a 3.7 that USGS revised, downgraded it to a magnitude 3.0. That earthquake was close to the area of the New Madrid failed rip system and the Greenville fault system. And I'll bring it out and go back up to where these recent earthquakes have been happening. Since 1776, there has been over, over 300 earthquakes recorded in Ohio of a magnitude 2.0 or greater. 15 of those 300 earthquakes reportedly caused minor damage to moderate damage. The most destructive earthquake to ever have taken place in Ohio was back in 1937. That was near Anna, Ohio. And that was a magnitude 5.4. Here you can see some of the historical earthquakes. We got a 4.1, 4.7, 4.2, 4.7, say that um, earthquakes of a magnitude 6 are possible in this area. Though uh, magnitude 5 have been the greatest. Uh, we got here um, a 5.0 in 1986, a 4.0 in 2011, a 4.5 in 2001. Here on the Ohio.gov page for earthquakes, they have a few more earthquakes listed. January 4th, a magnitude 3.50. Uh, January 5th, a 2.04. January 6th, a 1.54. Here is an image of that 3.0 earthquake. And they actually have marked out for you the first wave, the P wave of the earthquake, and then the S wave of the earthquake. Now remember, the P wave is what you hear when you hear the rumble. It's uh, an earthquake wave that creates sound. The S wave will not go through the liquid core of the Earth. It basically goes um, around the outside layers of the Earth. I call it the uh, surface wave. Whereas the P wave will go directly through the Earth. So did you feel this earthquake? If so, um, like I said, it was just before 4 a.m. local time today, January 27th, 2022. They listed it as close to Lake Line. Over here we have Timber Lake. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for subscribing. And thank you very much for your support. You know who you are. I really appreciate your support. Please stay safe and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.